Abhivyakti India's future classroom. In today's episode of numerical ability, the first question is what approximate value will come in place of question mark in the given questions you are not expected to calculate the exact value. The first question is 1810 upon 24 multiplied by 7.95 plus 11.02 multiplied by 18.88 which is equal to question mark minus 306 Here since we have to calculate the value not the exact value so we can write all these numbers by rounding it. So you will get 1810 divided by 24 multiplied by 7.95 it means 8 plus 11.02 that is rounded to 11 multiplied by 18.88 that is 19 which is equal to question mark I replace with x minus 306. So here we will solve this as 8 ones are 8, 8 threes are 24 and 3 ones are 3, 3 six are 18, 3 zeros are 0 and 3 threes are 9 approximately. So it will be 603 plus 11 into 19 that is 209 that is equal to x minus 306 so it will be 812 plus 306 that is equal to x and therefore x is approximately equal to 1118 so the question mark will be replaced by 1118 the approximate value the next question is 2775 multiplied by 160 divided by square root of question mark which is equal to 5550 so here this can be solved as 2775 multiplied by 160 divided by 5550 is equal to square root of x so this will be equal to 0 and 0 will be get cancelled 5 ones are 5 5 ones are 5 5 ones are 5 5 fives are 25 5 fives are 25 and 5 fives are 25 111 ones are 111 
and 5 is a 555 so it will be 5 into 16 that is equal to root x so 16 5 is a 80 so root x is equal to 80 and squaring both the sides you will get x is equal to 80 square and so x will be equal to 6400 so the question mark in this case will be replaced by 6400 another question is 24.98 multiplied by 16.02 sorry it is 160.02 bracket square divided by 7.98 multiplied by 15.04 multiplied by 38.93 that is equal to 130 multiplied by square of the question mark so rounding the numbers 24.98 that is 25 multiplied by 160.02 that is 160 bracket square so it is 160 into 160 divided by 7.98 that is 8 multiplied by 15.04 that is 15 multiplied by 39 and that is equal to 130 multiplied by x square question mark replaced by x so here 5 3 is a 15 5 3 is a 15 and 5 2 is a 10 3 1s are 3, 3 1s are 3, 3 3s are 9, then it is 8 1s are 8, 8 2s are 16, 8 0s are 0, 0 1s are 0, and so you will get x square is equal to 25 multiplied by 20 multiplied by 32 multiplied by 13 this is 25 multiplied by 20 multiplied by 32 multiplied by 13 divided by this number is shifted to another side so it will be 130 so if you solve this you get it 25 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 32 13 1s are 13 13 10s are 130 and so this will be 10 and this will be 3.2 so the next number will be 25 into 2 into 3.2 which is equal to 1600 so x square is equal to 1600 taking square root of both sides you will get x is equal to 40 so the question mark will be replaced by 40 now the another question is 71.98 percent percent of 1200 plus 35.06 percent
of 270 which is equal to question mark percent of 600 So 71.98 it means 72 percent of 1200 it means 72 by 100 72 percent multiplied by 1200 so these two zeros will get cancelled and you will get 72 into 12 so it will be 72 into 12 plus 35.06 it means 35 uh, percent of 270 so 35 by 100 is equal to 270 that is equal to 35 multiplied by 2.7 which is equal to x percent of 600 that is x by 100 into 600 two zeros which get cancelled so it will be x into 6 so 72 by 12 that is equal to 864 plus 35 into 2.7 that is equal to 105 which is equal to 6x shift x to other side and you will get 969 divided by 6 that is equal to x and so x is equal to approximately equal to 100 66. Therefore, the question mark will be replaced by the value 166, which is the approximate value. Another question is 7702 divided by 43.06. plus 25.11 multiplied by 45.88 which is equal to question mark multiplied by 15 first we will write the question by rounding the figures so it will be 7702 divided by 43 because 43.06 is rounded to 43 plus 21.23.11 sorry 25.11 that is 25 multiplied by 45.88 that is 46 which is equal to x into 15. Now this is equal to 179 plus 1150 divide this by 43 and the product of these two will be 1150 divided by 15 shift 15 to the other side it will go to denominator which is equal to x and therefore it will be 1329 divided by 15 is equal to x and therefore x is equal to 88.6 so the question mark will be replaced by the approximate value that is 88.6 or 89 or 88. Friends, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you might have enjoyed. If yes, please.
please like it share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe so that you will get all updates right into your mailbox thank you very much friends you might have enjoyed this video then go to thumbs up button and click then go to share tab and share with your friends on facebook twitter google plus and many more and to get the updates right in your mailbox don't forget to subscribe thank you very much